hi. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, it's just, I'm, I'm always laughing at like how I greet you. So I did a, I've done some videos recently where I've talked a lot about waterproof mascara and overwhelmingly people have been like, bro, it's so hard to remove. <laughs> so I wanted to show you how I do it. Um, because a lot of people have said that like waterproof mascara can damage their lashes and uh, I think mostly that's like exacerbated by the fact that it's really hard to remove and it probably just feels like you're doing more damage and just irritating your eyes and stuff. So um, I just wanted to show you what I use, what I do to remove it. Let me just sweep the, sweep the little blondies out of the way so you can see my gigantic forehead. Um, so obviously I'm going to get this stuff out of the way. This is the slip silk thing. Any of these things are the same. It's not necessary. Ziva, <laughs> don't open the door like that. That was so creepy. Okay, so the product that I use to remove waterproof mascara or just waterproof ma makeup in general is the Good Molecule, <laughs> wow, start over, Good Molecules Cleansing Balm. You guys have probably heard me talk about this a million times. I don't know what it is. I use the uh, Inky List cleansing balm like most days when I'm just removing like, you know, regular makeup or um, sunscreen or something. But I think the fact that this is a solid, it just helps it break down waterproof makeup so much better. So I'm gonna take like a pretty generous amount of this. All right, I don't know how much that is. Like a teaspoon? I don't actually know how much a teaspoon is. I took like a pretty decent amount. Let me zoom you guys in. Almost, I almost dropped it. What's nice about this is that like it sort of heats up with the um, ASMR. <laughs> heats up with um, the warmth of your skin. And then I'm just gonna kind of like go onto my eyes first. And I do like very gentle, obviously I have to do this with my eyes closed. I do very gentle like circular motions and I just kind of like, I'll do circular motions with all my fingers, then I'll go back and forth. And all I'm doing is just kind of like really gently working this into the lashes. So I'm not scrubbing, I'm hardly like pushing on my lashes at all. You really don't need like that much force. And you can kind of feel like as the product starts to break down and where, you know, where it's still like clinging to the lash. So circular motions and then back and forth. And I literally can hardly feel this. Okay, so now I'm just gonna do this. Pull it down <laughs> so that it's not all like in my eyes, which it obviously is going to be. This is really hard to do with contacts in. I have to take my contacts out. <laughs> okay, now I'm, now I'm going in blind. Um, okay, so once it's broken down like that, now I'm gonna go in with my makeup eraser. Um, this is actually a collaboration with Makeup Eraser. So you guys have probably heard me talk about these as well. I've definitely shared them in favorites videos. I have so many of them, but they have like a softer side and then the shorter side that's like a little bit more exfoliating. So I have like a bowl of water here. I'm just gonna get this wet. What's nice about this is because of the five, the little fibers, it's super, first of all, it's super soft. It's way better than like any other kind of face cloth. Like I can't believe I ever used those. So I'm going to take the soft side and I'm just going to kind of like really gently drag downward. What's nice about these is that because of the fibers, you don't even really need a product to remove your makeup, like you're supposed to be able to just use this with water and it's super gentle. Like, I don't know about you guys, but I have definitely like washed my face with other face cloths and it just like hurts, especially the eye area. You see, you have no product now, <laughs> it moves so fast. Okay, I'm just gently like patting with warm water to make sure I got everything around my eyes. Okay, waterproof mascara gone, <laughs> so easy. It looks weird because the rest of my makeup is on. Um, but so now I would just like, you know, usually I would just do my whole face with that stuff and um, the cloth, but you know, this was about waterproof mascara. Anyway, those are the products that I use. Uh, if you're interested in makeup, the makeup eraser, it's by far my favorite washcloth ever. Um, I was just buying it on Sephora. I got like so many of them so that I could just like use one each night and then, you know, 
toss it in the laundry. But they actually just, um, first of all, they sent me this one, look how cute, adorable. They have these little like refresh sets. First of all, it comes in a little cute little pouch, travel pouch. And what they are, are these little like um, individual guys, see? Little mini, little minis, and there's seven of them. So you can pretty much just use like one each day and then just like toss it in the laundry at the end of the day or at the end of the week, you wash them and then you start all over. Uh, so that's just gonna like make sure that you're not reusing an old towel that's gonna have like grow bacteria on it and like ruin your face, you know? Um, so this one's super cute. I love all the colors that it comes with. And they're super soft, so you don't have to use a, you know, oh, I dropped something. Makeup wipes, because it's just like so, makeup wipes, cotton rounds, um, all of those things are just like so wasteful. Like you just go through them like crazy. So, um, and I've actually tried other reusable, co reusable cotton rounds and they're so uncomfortable or they just like fall apart in the dryer. But I haven't had any, pro I mean, this is a new set, but I haven't had any problems with these at all. Like they stay soft. Uh, I really like the um, like the side that's a little bit shorter for exfoliation. Just remember, you don't have to like scrub with it, you know? Like just because you're using an exfoliating side doesn't mean you need to scrub. It also comes with a little um, washing pouch so you can throw them all in here and then throw them in the washer. What did I drop? Oh, it's just the uh, instructions. Um, so now for the rest of my face, I'm just going to get that washcloth wet and I'm just gonna really gently wipe away the rest of my makeup. Just to like show you like how you can use it. I typically would just go in with the um, cleansing balm for everything. But it just like, you know, pulls everything off. Anyway, so Makeup Eraser gave me a code for you guys. I can't remember what um, the amount is off. You guys know how I am with codes, I'm terrible. Um, but all of this stuff will be linked down below if you're interested in trying this. I highly recommend it. It's like super, so much better than like a regular washcloth. If you're using a regular washcloth, I don't know what you're doing. Or like cotton rounds. So fresh and so clean. And I can't see anything because I had to take my contacts out. I'm in this so blind right now. Um, all right guys, that's it. Just a quickie. I just wanted to show you how I remove waterproof mascara, waterproof makeup. You saw obviously I had like liner in my waterline. Like there was quite a bit of <laughs> black around my eyes um, and it comes off like really easily with this combination. So um, obviously I'll link everything down below, but particularly if you're interested in the makeup eraser, um, check that out, you can get a discount, you know. Uh, all right guys, that's it. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed. Everything's linked down below. Um, let me know what your favorite products are to remove waterproof makeup in general. Uh, I feel like I like my system, but you know, I'm always down for like a new cleansing balm. Uh, all right, guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.